All right, so today I'm at work, and it made me think about making a video. Something happened. Like nine times out of ten, I really don't have a problem with gay people. It's when, it's when their flaming gayness comes into my world that I have a problem with it. Like we're getting to the point now where I just can't understand a word that they're saying. That's that's the problem that I'm having. It's, it, I'll ask them a question, and then I can't understand what they're talking about. So I remember one time. I was at work, and the building that I was working in was having problems with the telephone lines. So I was down in the parking lot messing with the system, and I couldn't find anything wrong with the phone lines. So I went, to, I went out into the garage and asked somebody, you know, walking around, you know, excuse me, um, the building reported some problems with Verizon, whatever. I don't see any problems. Have you been having problems with uh, your Verizon phone lines? He said, oh, I don't have Verizon. I have Vonage. I said, I beg your pardon? He said, I don't have Verizon. I have Vonage. I said, okay, okay, okay. Okay. You mean Vonage? He said, yes. Vinage. I said, okay, okay, okay. I see where this is going. I can't, I can't understand you. You don't understand me. Even the commercial says Vonage, but you want to play games with words, and I ain't got time for it. It's getting to the point now where I need like a gay Rosetta Stone so I can understand what the these people are saying. And this brings me to today. Now today, I went up to College Park to go get some CDs. I get the CDs, and I'm sitting in my car, playing on my phone. That's normally what I do. My spare time, I play on my phone. So I see a guy, and he's like going to each car, and talking to him, soliciting, whatever, trying to get somebody to buy something. And he comes over to me. Well, he doesn't come to the driver's side. He came over to the passenger side. And he was like, And I looked, huh? You know how you don't want to look something, you just, but you, And he was like, roll your window town. Roll your window town. I said, what? Roll my window down? I said, I said just come around to the passenger. Just, just give me, come around to the driver's side. Stop acting stupid. So he come around there, he said, <laughs> Oh my God, I can't believe you. <laughs> you went so crazy for telling me to come around to the driver's side. <laughs> What's all the patent about? I don't know. He was like, <laughs> oh my God, you went so crazy for telling me to go <laughs> to, the, to the driver's side. I said, yeah, man, what's, what, what's up, man? What you, cause you gotta, you gotta, yeah, man, yeah, man, what you need, man? What's up? What's going on? What the fuck? Well, my name is Kobori. I said, excuse me? I beg your pardon? My name is Kobori. And I'm, what kind of cell phone you got? Who is your courier? What? Who is your courier? Like, that's, that's him speaking clearly now. Who is your courier? Who is my carrier? That's what you're trying to say. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, AT&T. You got a business card. I got a what? You got a business card. Nah, nah, I, I ain't got no business card. What do you what do you want? What do you need? Well. I broke at the ATT T store in Tyson's Corner and we give half off of all cell phone plans. Okay, so like I don't wanna know what type of favors. I need to do to get this half off. I just don't want to. I'm. I'll pay full price. I don't care. I, I'll pay double. But I'm not dealing with Komori to find out what I got to do to get this half off my cell phone plan. So don't even worry about it. But I see he's being persistent. So I'm like, so he was like, I mean, so okay, okay. So just you got a pen, okay. So just take down my number, okay. And he even say the numbers, gay like. <sighs> 
In school, we learn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He can't even pronounce numbers correctly. I'm sorry. He, 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 he can't do it. Okay, okay, 202. 202. Okay, my number is 703. 03. Man, just what's your motherfucking number, man? Stop playing around. Come on, Ori. They're killing me out here, man. Just just act normal. I, I can remember growing up and when I was over my grandmother's house and my uncle would come in the house and he would say, Y'all better tighten up around here. Y'all better tighten up. And we all be sitting around, you know, we little kids like we need to tighten up. I can't stand him. We can go home. He don't even live here. I hate him. And when dude was talking to me and, and rambling, that's all I could think about was Dude need to tighten up. That's that's what he needs to do. When when you talk to me from now on, tighten up. 